you guys absolutely crushed my last video when we reviewed the um the the footage of FNAF 1 running on Xbox One. It got over a thousand views, which is just freaking crazy. And if you missed that, don't worry, let me help you out. There's an icon right up there. It should pop up right about now. Unless my editing is pretty crap. You can go check that out. Um but if you don't own an Xbox One and you own a PlayStation 4, then this video is for you. Not too long ago, Click Team released footage of FNAF 1 running on the PlayStation 4, and it includes some things that we have not seen yet, so let's not waste any more time. Let's review the footage. Like usual, we're gonna have no face cam so you guys can see the entire screen, and it starts off with two stars, which means that they would be in Night 6, but have not beaten for 20 mode in custom night. And they also have the unlock screen right here, which we will see shortly. As you can see, they hit the unlocks menu, and here we can see what I, I believe says unlimited power, fast nights, and I can't really see what that says. Um, the footage is, oh, here we go. So we have unlimited power, fast nights, and radar map. These we have seen, we've seen two of these in the FNAF 4 game where the knights go faster and the radar map tells you where the animatronics are throughout the entire building. Unlimited power is obviously what it says, you have unlimited power. So what, what it seems like, you can turn these on either after you've beaten Night 6 but I have a feeling that these can just be turned on whenever you like. Um, for those new players, they can have unlimited power, the knights go faster, and they can see where the characters are. But for more experienced players, they can turn all those off and just have the classic FNAF experience. And you can see just how easy it is to switch, um, to turn those on and off, and they go into night 6. A little bit of loading, but not a lot. We can then see us in the cameras, scrolling, and we can actually see where the characters are thanks to the radar map. We can see Freddy right here, Bonnie, Chica, and Foxy. They have their little profile pictures next to the camera that they are in, so that can be very helpful for new players. Close out of the cameras. Just kind of looking around the office. Oh, Chica has gone. And we can see that her profile picture has moved to Cam 7, the restrooms, and we can see her right there. So the radar map can be very, very helpful if you cannot find a character. Chica has then moved to the kitchen, as you can see. Oh, she is now currently moving back to the restrooms. Bonnie is on the move as well. Freddy staying in the same place, and Chica has moved back to the kitchen. Freddy, I mean Bonnie, sorry, has moved to the back stage, and Chica has moved to Cam 4A, which is the east hallway. Again, you can see just how easy it is to switch cameras. Chica and Bonnie have moved once more. Chica moving back to the dining area, and Bonnie moving back to the, um, what's it called, backstage. So you can see, this is very, very helpful again for new players, because you can see where everyone is at any given time. Bonnie moving around the lower part of the map, Chica sticking to the top. Bonnie now at the door. We close it, open it, lights on. Monitor open, and we can see a jump scare. The jump scares are surprisingly short, but can still provoke the player, I guess you could say. And then we, uh, we die. Rest in peace, Mike. And we can see the game over sc screen. The game over screen, gosh. Well, that was FNAF 1 running on the PlayStation 4. Didn't really offer much. We've kind of seen everything already, but I feel like this one gave us the most information because it showed off the radar map, 
the unlimited power, and I don't believe that they had fast nights on, but that's kind of self-explanatory. We also got to see a jump scare, we got to see Bonnie's jump scare, pretty short, um, but, you know, at, le at least we get to see a jump scare. We also saw Bonnie at the door, we saw, we, we just saw those things, saw the cameras in action, we saw it looking around the room. I love these videos, they show off so much, and I can't wait for the ports. I believe they only have to show us two more, which is the iOS and the Android FNAF running on those two. So, hopefully we'll get those soon, um, but for now, that's it. Again, if you missed my um, review of the, um, gah, what is it called, the Xbox One, the Xbox One and the Nintendo Switch, I'll put up end cards right here. Hopefully they appear soon if they're not up already. But thank everyone so much for watching, and I will see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.